So our, t our test system is, is, is a little bit different than the forensic testing system, but it, it's also very good and very accurate and almost, um, when we compare um, our methodology to the Headspace, we get almost, we get the exact same results and when we compare and with peer yeah. laboratory comparisons, but what we do is what this, and I think the jury needs to know this, um, maybe some of you might understand the chemistry behind it, um, but um, we do, um, a pa we take the patient sample and it's based on, um, we add, because this, when there's alcohol in the, in the specimen, um, we add actually in the test system alcohol dehydrogenase, it's the same enzyme that's in the patient's body. In addition, we add a surplus of NAD to it. Uh, NAD is similar to NADH, they get converted back and forth. Um, so when we put it on our test system, um, it's um, alcohol uh, uh, dehydrogenase is in there and what happens is when there's alcohol, it combines with NAD that we add to it, it creates NADH. And then in our machine, there's um, a spectrophotometer which can m monitor the, the rate of NADH production over baseline. Um, and we use, um, there's, a, there's a, something that measures, um, NA, uh, a photometer that measures the NADH production it looks at light in this physics and looks at 340 nanometers and it's pretty accurate. It will monitor, it will, it will tell you, print, uh, give you a, it will tell the system how much NADH is produced and that amount is directly p proportional to the alcohol uh, in the patient's sample. So it's a, it's a 